Hi guys, how are ya? All right. We are back with Dragonite's Origins. And we are going to the proving grounds. Hopefully not to actually poison someone. With a drug. Um Right. So the proving grounds I forgot where it was. Come back here, dirt pile. Done. Somewhere. Hey dudes, I'm not gonna compete. I'm I'm gonna heal. I'm here to track someone and then make sure that uh someone else. Turn around, Brand. No castless on the grounds. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Looks legitimate. Go on through then. Stay to the trenches. Grey Wardens don't need some eyesore getting between them and the fighter. Screw you, dude. Um. The spectators everywhere. Did you see that? Stones Ooh, embraced. It's Duncan. Stone met, and blessings on your house. That was the proper greeting for an outsider last time I visited Ozomar. Has it changed, or is there a reason you're looking at me so strangely? My apologies. The intricacies of dwarven society are still foreign to me. I meant no offense. My name is Duncan. I'd say of the Grey Wardens, but I suspect you already know that. Pleased to meet you. Uh... The Wardens are always looking for those who have the courage to spend their lives in battle against the Darkspawn. It's rare we find those with both the skill and the will. The best Wardens are ruthless to their enemies, compassionate to their friends, and inspiring to their troops. It's a lot to look for. But I hope to find it here, and I hope you also may find what you are looking for. Thank you, Duncan. I like you. I still like you. <laughs> uh, spectator, common scar. Stand back! I don't want to catch your diseases. Oh, screw you. All of those lovely people. So, I have no idea where I'm going. Disgusting! Get away from me! Okay, I can't go here. I probably can't go here either. They should send someone to pick up the trash. Ha ha ha. Um, can't go there. I want. I can't go back to the commons though. Hey, spectator. My brother is fighting in the fourth bout. Okay. Cool. But. You're heading for the arena. The trenches are that way. Okay. I made it to third showing in one of these. You may not think it's important. Yeah, of course, of course. <laughs> you can see it open. And apparently here is what I'm looking for. Oh, oh Christ almighty. We are the... Sod it. He's stone drunk. We could draw a dead man for his bout and still lose. <laughs> Rot's gonna kill us if we slip up here. He's already jumpy enough after that stunt with Ascaius. Hey, I just had an idea. So, you've been rubbing my nose at how you're the meanest thing with a blade, right? The bear's <laughs> armor is over there, and you're about the same size. You've got a heart of steel, Salraka. Get in the armor. Out three is next. Officer I feel like I should have used the truck because the <laughs> this is Fire not gonna go well. No more time. Make sure you have everything and go tell the proving guard you're ready to fight. And don't forget to keep your helmet down. Okay. Uh I don't have a helmet. So Da 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 da
stuff was out there. Holy moly. So, uh, mm. oh, is that? No, it's my hand. Ah, uh, papa. That's the hand. Yeah, those are all my hands, so. Let's equip. Edward's armor. Oh, we need to use this goddamn shield. Okay, sure. Um, guess that's all. Oh, no, no, no. Axe. And the shield, I guess, then because. Yeah, I'm not surprised about that. Do you know how heavy this armor is? Okay. Uh, um, this this already looks. Oh, Nana, I don't want to do this. It time for your bout. May fortune favor your fight, Averd. Are you ready? Harm. As you say. Yes, I am. This is a glory proving. Fought under the watchful eyes of the paragons of Ozomar for our honored guests. The Grey Warden, the warrior Everd, son of Gauken, will fight Officer Mylar, survivor of the battle at Car Ellerin. Oh yeah, I'm totally going to win. Totally. You honor me with this fight. May the stone show the boldest heart through the strongest arm. First warrior to fall <laughs> is vanquished. I'm all cocky and that's, that's all I have. All I have is goddamn. Really? Really? Uh, I guess all I have is. Hmm. Who are weapons? Okay, so this is all I have. Fantastic. I will defeat you. Let's hope it's enough because honestly I can only do so much. There we go. Minor is down. The winner is And I'm all bloody. Jesus. A truly memorable fight. The young cadet vanquishes the wily veteran. Healer, see to his injuries. The warrior Everd, son of Golton, will Ooh. fight last year's journeyman division champion, Adalbo, proven in glory before the stones. Yeah, you fantastic. honor me with this fight. May we both win glory in the eyes of our lords. First warrior to fall is vanquished. Fight! Hmm. Oh Christ, I don't know. There we go. The winner is Ibed. I like the armor. I really like the helmet. The ancestors have withdrawn their blessing and embraced a new champion on their field. The warrior of Ed, son of Golden. Will fight Lenka, silent sister in training. She has made her vows, but not completed her blooding. Will she be accepted into the legendary order? That will depend on her performance today. No, I kind of feel bad for her because I guess we are, she is not going to be accepted. First warrior to fall is vanquished. Fight! Unless I lose that quality. How about you then? Too fast for you. 
<laughs> Jesus Christ. Lenka went to the stone without a sound, as befits her vows. But it wasn't hard to see the blood that was spilled. Everd will advance to the final bout to determine the true champion of the ring against... What? My bout already? Uh... Hey! That's my armor! Who are you? How dare you disrupt this sacred... Wait, I know that man. That's a bird. Then what imposter did I fight? <laughs> uh... Remove your helmet, warrior, and let all who watched you see your face. Uh... Your skills are impressive, but you are one man. Show yourself, lest I call the guards and have them do it for you. This is not gonna go well. But sir, I'm a woman, no cast, and I defeated you also, I mean. Up. Hi. Insult the very nature of this proving. Guards, take this filth away. Hold your man, I pray you. This warrior has defeated the best you have to offer. Is that not what this proving is for? We are honored by your presence, warden. But this proving is not solely for you. There are laws which have governed this arena for a thousand years. This woman is no warrior. She is castless, rejected by the ancestors. Her very footsteps pollute the stone. She has no place here. Except as your champion. <laughs> exactly. Come on, dude. I bested all your guys. I'm awesome. Whether I have cast or not. Oh, I'm in jail. Of course I am in jail. How hard did they sodding hit you anyway? Did you have to put up such a fight? As soon as everyone saw your face, Brand, the place went mad. Shut all the doors, examined everyone for family and caste. One of the guards recognized me and figured we must be working together. Aww. They burned three candles to the stump interrogating me about who put us up to this. I think they knew, you know, about Barat. Yeah, I don't want anything to happen for you. I didn't look for a way out? Rika's not the only one in danger here. They could kill us. But these cells are built straight into the wall. And they confiscated all my lockpicks. What's it look like on your side? You see any way out? Good, you're awake. Barat will be glad to hear that. Uh, are we on? You caused a lot of trouble today. Barat lost a hundred sovereigns for Lord Volney. The entire proving was declared invalid, and the assembly already called for an investigation. You can't imagine the state Barat was in when he told me to get you. <laughs> you're not in their cells anymore. And I don't think I appreciate the time and money it took to bribe the right people to get you back. You got every guardsman at that proving thinking if he takes your head off, the ancestors will bless him forever. Oh, Christ, but they oh, know whose hand holds the whip. When Barat claimed you, they knew who's going to get to watch your last breath. Yeah, I don't scare so easily. I don't think scaring you is what Barat has in mind. You risked exposing him before the entire warrior cast. Now they're asking questions, and as long as you have tongues to answer them, you're a threat. Enjoy your last night together. Sorry we had to put you in separate cells, or I'd suggest you have a last tumble. <laughs> Barat will be by soon to make sure you maintain your silence. 
Well, that's one. That's all I can say. Not in a complex situation. But there's trouble. Okay, there's splinters. Ooh. Easy as hell. Hey guys. Oh god. So yeah, there's, there's some blood. We can't leave one man alive to tell Barat what we've done. Shed in this game because I haven't turned it off. So if that's something that um bothers you then tell then tell me. Or maybe yeah. I just oh my goodness. I mean I'm sorry I can't turn it off from somewhere, I can't remember where. You could put this on um two hand weapon. No. Oh, no. Why do I have hooked on a feeling <laughs> stuck in my head? Um. Oh, you're awake. Of course you are. So you can have daggers. Two. And then. There we go. Okay, I leveled up. And I feel like I want. Some strength and constitution. Oh god. I wanted to. Mm. How Okay. Dual. Dual strike advance. Sounds good for me right now. So let's see. I guess this is how. Get out. Not that way, apparently. Oh. Fudge. Fudge, should be fudge, fudge, fudge. I hope you're ready, let's get. Because. Oh, there's tugs. Dude, are you attacking on that? Is that a... Oh, it's sustained. And you're gonna have to move quicker than that. I'm just gonna move it here because I don't need to actually click it. I probably should have read it. So I know what the hell I'm choosing, but no. Short bow, cut the shield. And I'm off. At the helm. Alright. Rolling helmet. So why not? Um There we go, now we have helmets. Not so pretty, but it will do. I don't care for the pause before every battle, I need to quickly change that. that won't stop me. Someone really likes to bite. Bite the creepy. <laughs> hey dudes. How are you doing? Fine, I hope. My health is not the best, but it's alright. I do have a health potion, so that's awesome. Okay, green stone. And mushrooms. Let's see, what do I have in your barrels? Money? Why would you have money in your barrels? You weird, weird people. Okay. I'm glad I, I'm not too close to the forbid because tunnels uh, would be fun. Huh. Now I need 
there's more goddamn people to stop. Oh, okay, and that was a trap. A fire trap. Are you okay, dude? Come on, only one more. There we go. Let's see what's in this. Like booties, booties. I don't know. And I'm off. How you pronounce it? All right. I'm just gonna loot. This is just how I play. If I see something, I can loot. I will gladly loot it. Because who knows what treasure is inside. There's arrows that I don't really use right now, and I don't think there's any good spells. Uh, could you come out of hiding, please? <laughs> A fight? That won't stop me. What's the use of having you in my party if you're All not right. grenading? Huh? Huh? Mm. Oh crap. Am I supposed to go here? Am I supposed to go here? Can I go here? Okay. That does not bode well. That's going to be a fight, isn't it? <laughs> Cutting the whore free. If that freak of a sister of hers can't stay in her place, I don't need precious Rika <gasps> either. Rika? Is that the one you got all done up in lace? to get my hands on that. <gasps> oh, fuck you. I know what you mean. Ah, fuck you too. She's yours if you want her, boys. And let me tell you, it tastes as good as it looks. I am going to enjoy beating you guys up. So much. What in sod all is that doing out of its cage? Come on, boys. The little whore needs to learn her place. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. I am so going to fucking... Hurt you first, I'm just going to hurt your thoughts because less damage is great. Yeah, the other means the wrath is more challenging, let's see. Down he went. Did you see him there all when we're done with you? And you just charged in and sodding slaughtered him. You have to be the luckiest duster in Orzammar. Barat's dead, and we're standing here! Hail to the Sodding King! Yeah. Well, he sure was talking like she's still alive. I won't turn down the chance to go take another peek. Hey, could you tell Rika I killed him? I mean, it doesn't do you any good if she thinks you're the most virile warrior in all the stone. Good. An excellent point. Now let's go find somewhere to hide. Mm-hmm. It's all friendly panda. And I'm off. I promise. Um I need to find my sister. Is there my sister? Oh, can't unlock. I don't have a key. I'll get on it. Oh. I'll get on it. Thank you. I'll get on it. Not that there was anything. So we are going to put a soap. Apparently. Oh my god, this is not good news. Hmm. Rika better be alive. You're not supposed to be here. Wait, is that blood? Ancestors, protect me! Who cares? I need Rika. Huh. There they are! Seize the fugitive! Uh. Drop your weapons and walk down slowly. We will use force if you resist. Duncan? What are you all doing here? Your escape from Orzammar's prison had the guards baffled, it seems. 
<laughs> until one of them recognized your friend as Barat's man. Regardless, the penalty for impersonating a higher caste is death. Oh. If Barat is as influential as you say, perhaps he also masterminded this Everd's impersonation. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. Do not take that tone with a Grey Warden. And maybe you should stop singing your own praises long enough to hear what's going on. <laughs> Barat's dead. So I think you and your guardsmen owe us a little gratitude. He's dead? Barat had many enemies, but also powerful allies. They... Barat would have butchered us if she hadn't killed him first. Your friend has once again demonstrated her courage. We Grey Wardens travel far and wide in search of those with the potential to join our ranks. It seems I have found one. Oh. Let me make my offer formal. I, Duncan of the Grey Wardens, extend the invitation for you to join our order. This woman is wanted for treason. You can't do this. I can and I am. It would mean traveling to the surface lands and thus leaving your people. But it does offer you the chance to strike a blow against the Darkspawn and the Blight. Considering I'm dead anyway? Huh? <laughs> They're talking about let's get out of here now. Then before these witnesses, I hereby recruit you into the Grey Wardens. Know that you are most welcome. This is highly irregular. The warrior families will be most upset. Look at you, you duster. A warden. To think I knew you when you were stealing bread. <laughs> Before we brave the deep roads, I would like to make you a gift of this mace, since you have so few possessions of your own. It was once wielded by the warden Foral Idukan. I believe he was related to your king. I know you will continue his proud example. Aww. Goodbye, my friends, and thank you for your hospitality. Piece of paper. But but what about my sister? No one told me anything about my sister. <laughs> Oh, uh, you know, she's going to stay there, hopefully alive, hopefully not being traded to someone else. <sighs> also, I have a flying ant on my curtain right now. Um, I need to do something about that. We will be traveling south through the hinterlands to the ruin of Ostagar, on the edges of the Korkari Wilds. The Tevinter Imperium built Ostagar long ago to prevent the Wildens from invading the northern lowlands. It's fitting we make our stand here, even if we face a different foe within that forest. The King's forces have clashed with the Darkspawn several times, but here is where the bulk of the Horde will show itself. There are only a few Grey Wardens within Ferelden at the moment, but all of us are here. This blight must be stopped, here and now. If it spreads to the north, Ferelden will fall. Ho there, Duncan. King Caelan. I didn't expect a... A royal welcome? I was beginning to worry you'd miss all the fun. Not if I could help it, your majesty. Then I'll have the mighty Duncan at my side in battle after all. Glorious. The other wardens told me you'd found a promising recruit. I take it this is she? Allow me to introduce you, your majesty. There's no need to be so formal, Duncan. We'll be shedding blood together after all. Ho there, friend. <laughs> Might I know your name? <sighs> Whatever, sir. Let's let's uh. Pleased to meet you. The Grey Wardens are desperate to bolster their numbers, and I, for one, am glad to help them. Human lord. It's good to see one of the uh. honourable stout folk outside Aldemar. They would have laughed at me, but that's fine. Uh. Sounds like there's a story behind that. You must regale me with it sometime. I do. Mm -hmm. I'll make sure to have the finest dwarven brew brought up from the palace cellars. After we've dealt with the blight, of course. Sure. I've been to Aldemar. King Endrin invited my father to a grand proving long ago. How does Endrin fare these days? Good. I hope to work with him as well as my father did. Allow me to be the first to welcome you to Ostagar. The Wardens will benefit greatly with you in their ranks. <laughs> I'm sorry to cut this short, but I should return to my tent. 
Logan waits eagerly to bore me with his strategies. Your uncle sends his greetings and reminds you that Redcliffe forces could be here in less than a week. Ha! <laughs> Eamon just wants in on the glory. We've won three battles against these monsters, and tomorrow should be no different. Overconfident, some would say. Right, Duncan? <laughs> Your Majesty, I'm not certain the blight can be ended quite as quickly as you might wish. I'm not even sure this is a true blight. There are plenty of darkspawn on the field, but alas, we've seen no sign of an archdemon. Disappointed, Your Majesty? I'd hoped for a war like in the tales. You know, a king riding with the fabled grave wardens against a tainted god. But I suppose this will have to do. <laughs> no, I must go before Loghain sends out a search party. Farewell, grave wardens. Farewell, human lord. Oh my god, I don't know. I just don't feel like... I kind of like him. I don't know why. Well, what the king said is true. Ridiculous. They've won several battles against the darkspawn here. True. Despite the victory so far, the Darkspawn horde grows larger with each passing day. By now, they look to outnumber us. I know there is an archdemon behind this, but I cannot ask the king to act solely on my feeling. Yes, we should proceed with the ritual. Every recruit must go through a secret ritual we call the joining in order to become a Grey Warden. The ritual is brief, but some preparation is required. We must begin soon. Sure. Let's, let's get it done. Feel free to explore the camp here as you wish. All I ask is that you do not leave it for the time being. There is another Grey Warden in the camp by the name of Alistair. When you're ready, seek him out and tell him it's time to summon the other recruits. Until then, I have business I must attend to. You may find me at the Grey Warden tent on the other side of this bridge, should you need to. Okay. Oh. Yeah, I haven't played the Dwarven Castles beginning before, so I got that tune of it. It is cool. Well, yeah. Uh, this is where we will leave this. I'm just gonna quickly run to the camp. It's been over half an hour, <laughs> but then. Um... Hail! You must be the Grey Warden recruit that Duncan brought. Hi. This place hasn't seen such bustle in centuries. I'll wager. Need a hand getting anywhere? Try heading north. I think he was sent with a message to the mages. Thank you. Good luck to you then. Yeah. Uh, all the cutscenes that first day for a long, long time. But it's oh, okay, tempers and mages. Anyway, <laughs> next time we will start the joining ritual, hopefully, or at least preparing for it. But for now, if you liked it and would like to see more, click like and subscribe if you haven't, and I'll see you in the next one. Okay? Bye bye.